<laughs> morning, morning, morning. Uh, if you hear chickens, don't mind them. They're everywhere, so you might hear them. And there's some, there's a dog. I'm outside, so anyway. I just wanted to sit down with you guys and talk about the channel. There's been a lot of stuff going on this year and it's gonna continue to keep happening so i thought let's just cover some stuff so before i get too far into things i just wanted to thank everybody for 500 subscribers ah i was so excited a year ago when i moved to guam i had 19 subscribers i was very proud of those 19 subscribers but it's absolutely amazing to see that there's 500 of you now 500 plus I think I absolutely love all of the comments that I've been getting you guys telling me about you know your experience in Guam whether you've been traveling or you used to live here or you have family here you guys have been so supportive and I love talking to you guys and hearing all of your stories and everything so just thank you so much I'm having so much fun with the channel and so it's really cool to interact with you guys and see how you're feeling about the videos or learning new things from you guys sometimes you give me tips or tell me things that i had no idea about so thank you one thing really quick so i had made my one year on guam video and a lot of people think that now i'm leaving i'm not <laughs> I'm not leaving, I live here. I I love Guam. Uh, I decided to move to Guam with my boyfriend Joshua and his family. They are originally from Guam and I moved with them. So I'm not in the military and I'm not leaving. This is my home. So you guys can expect me to be here and still be making videos here. I just wanted to clear that up really quick. I wanted to clear that up as well because I do get some military specific questions about here on Guam and I I really don't know. If you guys have questions about Guam, I'll do my best to answer, um, but I'm still learning. You know, I've only been here for a year, so if you do have any questions, I'm going to try my best to answer them. Uh, the worst that can happen is I'm going to tell you I don't know. There's a dog moving behind me. Is she still? No. <laughs> Thanks, Pete. So anyway, I've only been here for a year, so I'm still learning. So, you know, the worst that can happen is I'm just going to say I have no idea. Moving on to like updates about my channel. So if you guys have seen my recent Japan videos, I'm super proud of them, okay? I finally got out of this weird presenter voice because I was so nervous on camera and you can still see it at the very beginning of my first Japan video, which I just like I hate watching, but like just get through that because I finally get so like me, like you guys can finally see like me and my personality and everything. I finally found a way of how I wanna do my videos. The quality was exactly what I was trying to aim for. What is she doing? <laughs> Hopefully gonna have more of a genuine feel, but also the amount of time I put into editing those videos and like the quality just seems way higher than the rest of my videos. So expect more vlogs and informative videos of that quality but i'm gonna bring it here for my guam videos just letting you guys know that higher quality videos also means more time so i'm gonna be taking more time in between my videos for research and editing and everything so videos will be spaced out a bit longer so i'm sorry about that but i just wanted to let you guys know because i'm i'm trying to take it seriously and i i really love making these videos so i want to take my time with them it might be a while until you guys get another guam video we were in japan in january and then we came back to guam and i had all of the editing to do for the japan videos and then in two weeks i'm going to palau and then I come back, so just <laughs> letting you guys know, it's gonna be a little bit of time before I can finally 
produce my next Guam video. But my next video will be a Guam video. Now I do want to be transparent. This isn't technically a fully Guam channel. So I will be making videos of my Palau trips or any other travels that I go on and whatever interests me. And then of course I'm going to be making some cool like deep dives about certain things here on Guam as well as vlogs. One of the biggest reasons I wanted to move to Guam was because of the travel opportunities. So I am going to be traveling around. So I hope you guys enjoy following me around for those trips whenever I go on them as well as my Guam stuff. Also, since my videos are going to have longer times in between them, I have plans to make some smaller content in between. So I was thinking about updates through shorts as well as anything interesting that happens to me on like, you know, whatever day if I see something cool about Guam, just making some shorts about them just so you guys can still see things while I'm still working on a video. And I was also maybe thinking about doing some live streams as well. I could go to a certain place on Guam um, and just go live. If you all think that you'd be interested in that, I could give it a shot. So just let me know if, if that's something that would be cool. You can also find me on TikTok. I post stuff about Mimi and Ruka there, clips around the island or drone shots. So you can check me out on TikTok as well. I'll be there. Also, if there's anything on Guam or in Japan or anywhere that we travel to that you want me to go and check out, let me know. Suggest them down in the comments and maybe I'll go to those places. I think that's about it. I just wanted to sit down with you guys and kind of go over what's going on and how I feel about the direction of the channel. So thank you guys so, so, so much for all of your support. I, it's genuinely appreciated. And I'm just really excited to see where my channel goes. So thank you again. And I'll see you next time. Bye.